So today I'm working with a brand called Superfrau and they're really cool in the sense that they try to eliminate food waste by taking the leftover liquid whey from the fermentation process of creating yogurt and they turn it into this like really healthy, fruity, delicious, kind of slightly fizzy drink. Uh, so we have like a really fun, colorful setup for each of their flavors with these really bright backgrounds and I had a lot of fun playing around with the different roots and styling for this shoot. And yeah, for the cucumbers, I figured out <laughs> in order to make them stand, you kind of have to use toothpicks to make it look like they're like defying gravity. So it took me like a couple tries of trying to balance these slices before I figured out the old toothpick trick. And thankfully, that did work out. Oh, there you go. It's like magic. I, well, I didn't think of this before. Yeah, there's like little blocks and things like that always set up to help hold certain slices up. A lot of times for colored cocktails, I'll just use like kombucha or juice. It's much cheaper than um, using actual alcohol. And then here, just clean up during the editing process and some final photos.
I've been getting in a lot of props for like a lot of like autumn, like Thanksgiving themed photo shoots that I'll be doing in the next month or so. And since I have like quite a few items, I thought I would do like a little bit of a props unboxing. I'm also going to put on my gloves because this is just me being paranoid. Um, or maybe it's just like my own messy behavior causing me unnecessary anxiety. Um, but I could have sworn I heard some like rustling in this area last night. Like, and my first thought whenever I hear something like that is like, it's a mess. But I'm like, I mean, like, usually a mouse is, like, looking for food or whatever, and there's, like, to my knowledge, no food that I've accidentally left in this area at all. Like, it's just all, like, photography prop stuff. But just in case, I'm going to wear gloves in case something just, like, pops up from this area. So you just, like, never know. So this was, like, a bunch of goodies that um, one of my clients ordered from Amazon which like honestly I don't really like to support Amazon but I do have to say when you're looking for specific photography props it really is a good source um, so I do end up looking on there a lot of the time Okay, well, there's, like, actually not as much as I thought there would be because there's, like, a ton of packaging in here. I think I'm okay with the fear of the mess uh, now, so I'm going to take off these gloves. Okay, so first thing that we have is... Oh, actually, I wasn't expecting this. This is great. So there's a bunch of... I'll take these out. There's a bunch of, like, little autumn leaves in all different colors are super cute. I love these colors. The only thing is they, they look really fake. Initially, I didn't think like these would be included, but that's actually really good that they are because I was legit gonna go to like Central Park or something and just collect like leaves off of the, the ground because I think some of them have been starting to drop but I don't know if they've been turning colors so it's just gonna be like a bunch of brown leaves but that's like good to have this option maybe they'll photograph differently we'll see and then up next we have oh okay at cinnamon sticks very autumnal I actually already have these but it's good to have like extra ones and then there's not as much in here as I thought there would be. I thought it was like the package of like everything for some reason. Um, and then we have um, for a Black Friday special photo, I have some clear plastic bags here. Yeah, so that's pretty much it for this box. Um, yeah, just kidding. I actually just went downstairs to double check and there was another box. So yeah, we get to continue the little uh, Amazon props haul so that I didn't just show you like three items because what a lame haul that would have been. Oh, okay. <laughs> There's just one item only um, in this box. Um, but these are so cute. They're like little white pumpkins. It's like really sophisticated autumn decor vibe without being like cheesy.
basically this is what I've cleared up so far from just like stuffing all of those like little random uh, cosmetics and skincare brands that I'm not working with at the moment or like I just don't have any ongoing projects with them right now and I'm just like clearing up some room for some additional brands like for new clients uh, that are going to be coming in in the next couple of weeks. So hopefully this is like enough space without it being like too overwhelmed. This is pretty much as much as I could have cleared up. I mean, all this stuff needs to be like better organized. It's kind of just like tossed in there for now. Yeah, but this is like where we're at. It's like I just, I've just made peace with the fact that it's just never going to be like a clean slate like it's always gonna look like kind of a mess <laughs> like a mess in progress but hey that's the life of a product photographer when you also work from home which happens to be a micro studio